Hello internet friends, this is Tim Schrock from Design Build Solutions. On today's Tech Tip Tuesday video, I want to show you how you can turn this uh, trim situation into this. Let's get started. Thanks so much for watching my videos. Thanks for interacting, for commenting, subscribing, for watching. If you enjoy these uh, videos and you learn something from the education that I provide, would you consider uh, supporting me over on patreon.com slash design build solutions for as little as two bucks a month, five bucks a month, all the way up to 50 bucks a month, uh, depending on what you need. Uh, if you need help um, with your projects or whatever, I can help you with that. Uh, thanks so much for your consideration. Again, check it out over at patreon.com. have several different tiers of support available. Um, again, just for as little as a cup of coffee each month, that would help this education uh, continue coming to you each week. Thank you. Now, uh, into this uh, tip here today. I have this situation where I've got a mold uh, window, mold door unit. Um, that I really don't like the black interior here on the um, right right in here I want that to be wood because that's what it typically would be now black out here is fine with me um, unfortunately I, I'd like this to be wood like like the jam like the window is but that's not um, I don't believe that's possible um, so I'm going to actually break this down into a couple different units into their individual units um, and you'll notice that I cannot make that jam uh, be different unfortunately if we open this up the trim exterior is color white red oak medium if we yeah the doors just don't give us that option like the windows do if i go into window you have the sash as a different material than the trim exterior it'd be really nice if chief would allow us to do that but we don't have that functionality right now so i'm going to paint that back at white and i'm going to go ahead and block these together first the first row of these doors and then select that window and block that together like that now i'm going to paint this trim the wood color that i want it there we go now i want the exterior trim to be black um, so what i'm going to have to do is actually take that mold unit and turn off the exterior casing and we'll have to create the manual casing the way we want it um, I don't know, it. if we turn off the exterior casing we get a get a uh, Let's do this. Here I thought it was going to be easy. Go figure, right? <laughs> if I turn off the exterior casing, the jam should remain, but it does not. So we'll just have to go into a little more depth. And that's okay. We can we can deal with it, right? All right. So I'm 
I'm going to take an elevation. And I'm going to draw on the casing exterior uh, layer, since that's what we are drawing. And we're going to draw that casing at three and a half. That's what's drawn. So I'm just going to draw this all the way around. As I'm dragging this before I let go, I, I make that, uh, I hit the tab key so that I can draw exactly three and a half inches. Now I'm going to hit the 3 key, which breaks the polyline. And when I click once there, I've got that diamond. I could drag the diamond, and I'd, I'd take both uh, sections of the line like that. Or I'm just going to drag this end, and that creates the 90-degree uh, corner. I could draw a molding polyline around this if I wish, but that's not how I'm going to do it. I'm just going to create a polyline solid, three quarters of an inch thick, it's fine. Where'd it go? <laughs> Oh, I see it. There we go. There it is. So really, the, the trick with this is if you don't like what's um, not working, turn it off in the, in the object and then um, build it, create it uh, with a manual. I know it's a frustrating workaround, um, but it, it really can, it's, it can be done there. For this one, for the side jam, I'm going to create something on the door, well, I can yeah, I can keep it on the casings exterior layer. And we'll make the polyline solid in a vertical direction. So it'll be 80. Let's see if this shows up. There we go. and let's copy this about the center of that. So there's how I really want it to look. I've got the black trim on the exterior. I've got the wood molds between the units and even the wood casing on both sides there. All right. I hope this has been uh, useful for you. Um, I, I thought of this as I was working with some training uh, for a client this week that uh, we were struggling trying to get the proper materials to show up correctly on the stairs, um, on her stairs. So th there's several different, different scenarios where you really, if you want it to look just right, um, this, is, this is the way we have to work around this. Um, so if you have uh, some training needs or, or uh, some, just some questions, check into my Patreon account, patreon.com slash designbuildsolutions. I have several different tiers there, as well as some customized um, four-week training that I can help you beginner, intermediate, or advanced uh, topics in Chief Architect. 
give me a give me a shout on uh, Twitter or Instagram, Facebook, or through my website, designbuildsolutionsllc.com. Thanks so much for watching. Have a wonderful week.